Okay, so let's talk about how to navigate this class. So um, this is the Canvas course page right here. And so once you log on, you can access this either through my portal or at deanza.instructure.com. And then you enter in your uh, student ID and your my portal password, and that will log you on to Canvas. Um, you'll end up on something called the dashboard and on the dashboard, unfortunately, because I have this set up under what's called student view, I can't see the dashboard. You will be able to see yours, but one of the things you'll be able to do is you'll see a list of the classes you're currently enrolled in. You'll click on our class and you'll see a page that looks like this. Now there's a few things on here that I just want to point out real quick and then I'll kind of tell you the general procedure of the course. Now I'm recording this before the course formally begins so a lot of these links aren't active yet but once you see this they will be active. So the biggest link, the one that I want you to know, love, take out for a bottle of wine sometime this summer is the modules link. And the reason why is because everything and anything you'll need for this class you'll find under modules. Um, the very first thing you'll see is our course syllabus and then a list of discussion forum guidelines, basically what I want you to know about the class, the policies, the procedures, my, my, my rules, and, and all of that information. Um, and so that's going to be right up here. Then the next pinned thing are discussion forms. So what I'm actually doing is Instead of for every module, I'm going to have you do a discussion for every week. And for more information on what you should be putting in your discussions, check out the forum guidelines. Um, and I'll actually go through the discussions a little bit more in detail in a few minutes. Um, but that being said, so there'll be one discussion every week. And then below that is the modules themselves. So all the content in this course um, and all of the assessments, the quizzes, the final, the um, we're not there yet, don't worry, but the quizzes, the lectures, everything is grouped up into modules. And for this summer class, we'll be doing two modules a week. Um, this right here is module one. And the way that I lay out this module is I want you to go in order. So the very, very top item on the list is the first thing you want to do. Then the second thing are lecture videos. And then I have a PDF copy of the lecture slides themselves um, in case there's something you missed on the videos or if the videos, really they're just one guide for you or they're just one tool that you can use. Um, if you'd rather just use the lecture slides themselves, that's fine. Um, these first three things are more FYI things. The first deliverable is going to be the module activity. Um, every module will have some kind of activity where you're either going deeper in what you're learning or you're applying what you're learning. Um, and so every module will have an activity. Then below that, there is a review sheet. This review sheet actually covers everything in these above items as far as everything I want you to know for the quiz. So if you want to know what's on the test, this right here tells you what's on the test. Then I give a practice quiz, and for this practice quiz, you can try it as many times as you want. You can see the answers immediately afterwards. You can get everything you need to know for it. And then finally, the quiz itself. Um, and the way I do quizzes in this class is I try to make them very low risk, high reward. So you actually get three opportunities to take the quiz. Um, you don't get to see the answers until you've done your final submission, but until that point, you can take the quiz, see how you did. Um, anything that you felt uncertain about, go back and restudy. Come back, retake the quiz. Um, most people do really well on them. Um, but that's really the in and out of this class is really these modules right here and the weekly discussions. Um, the other thing that I want you to know about this class is the announcements. So every time a module opens, Every time I need to communicate anything significant to the class, I'm going to do it through these announcements. Um, many people actually have settings on their Canvas account to have announcements directly emailed to them. Um, if you don't have that yet, 
please set that up because then you'll get everything immediately as soon as I send it out, you'll get it. Um, but even if you don't, check your Canvas page regularly, at least twice a week, if not more often. That way, if there's any announcement, any deadline change, um, any anything you need to know will be done through announcements. Um, and then if you want to view your progress in the class, you can do that here. And really, that's it. I've tried to make this class very easy to navigate, very simple. Um, but give yourself some time. It takes a few days to get the hang of things. Um, but I promise you, once you get the hang of it, it goes really well. All right. So um, that's it for how to go through this class. Um, let me know if you have any questions. And best of luck. You've got this.